Hello, and welcome to Pokemon TCG Daily. Fellow trainers, I hope you're having a fantastic day whenever you're watching this. Thank you so much for coming and check out my channel. Uh, today was actually my birthday, so I have a handful of Pokemon booster packs. I've gotten a couple I've bought, and some have been from friends and family. So we're gonna go ahead and just jump into a video. It's been a minute. I think the last video I uploaded was around the 4th of July, I think. Um, but let's go ahead and jump into this. We have 14 Pokemon booster packs here, so an array of, uh, array of different things and stuff to go through. So let's go ahead and jump into this first Pokemon booster I hope you're having a fantastic night whenever you're watching this. It's been a minute. I really do miss doing the videos uh, daily. For those of you who do remember that, uh, there are a handful of people. I can't believe people are actually still coming out to check out my channel even a month, month late, um, uh, months later. My channel's actually grown by about 20 subscribers, which is awesome. But in case if you are brand new to my channel, I did one Pokemon booster pack opening every single day for over an entire year straight. Um, it's something I'm going to try to get back into the groove of things. Hopefully, I want to be able to upload videos every single uh, every single Wednesday and Friday that is the long-term goal I have some other content planned and I'm also really looking forward to the upcoming Pokemon season but with all that let's go ahead and burn through some Pokemon booster packs we are going to kick things off with, I think that was a Unbroken Bonds booster pack. We kick things off with a Water Energy. We have the Stadium card Power Plant right there. Next, we have a Charbuck. Uh, we continue things with a Torquet. We have a Jigglypuff. We have a Krabby. We have a Riolu. We have an Esper. We have Porygon. We have a Froakie. And our last card in this Pokemon booster pack is a Kingler. Let's go ahead and move on to the next Pokemon booster pack. Um, yeah, things have just been really, really well. So I definitely know what type of content I want to make on this channel. I was actually always really impressed with how much, the, how well the booster pack openings did for how, um, not like uh, redundant they were, but that people did actually come to watch them. We do have a white coat here, so I do think that actually means something. This was an XY booster pack. So we have a, we have a variety of Pokemon booster packs today. We have some XY, we have more Unbroken Bonds. Uh, I think we have some Detective Pikachu packs here as well. Three from the back from XY, and let's go ahead and see what we have in this Pokemon booster pack. We kicked things off with a Haunter. Next, we have a Gramble. Have to make sure Parallel City, awesome for Expanded, always great to have. We have a Doduo, we have a Ghastly, we have a, Wob uh, a Woobat, we have a Swablu, we have a Snover. Our reverse holo for this pack is Azorua, and we pull a full art Mewtwo EX. That is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and set that one over. I love the textures and stuff on that card. I actually have a sleeve right over here. I can put this in right now. Um, yeah, that is actually a pretty cool pull. Um, not too shabby to start things off. It's been very uh, busy in Pokemon, so the rotation will officially happen in a couple weeks. So those of you who might be new to the Pokemon trading card game, every year a handful of cards get rotated out. So like, um, like some of these booster packs right here are only for expanded format. And this is the kind of thing I actually content I really want to make, uh, just kind of breaking down a lot of different uh, topics about the Pokemon trading card game. Um, I am going to be traveling to more regionals and stuff. Regionals have been announced for the upcoming year. That is That was exciting to wake up to that news. I think it was like Tuesday or Monday of this, just this past week. So I was very excited to hear all that stuff. I think I did the uh, card trick wrong for XY, but let's go ahead and see what we have in this Pokemon booster pack next. We kick things off with a Pyroar. And next we have an Armored Fossil Shield on. We have a Flaffy we have a Monferno, we have an Apom, we have a Drifloon, we have a Mareep, a Fletching, a Yanma, and a Litwick. Really pretty. That Litwick actually looks really, really cool. I actually like that. I'm going to set the reverse halls and stuff off to the side as well. I haven't opened, I have not opened any XY Pokemon booster packs in some time. Let's go ahead. We are here now with a Fates Collide booster pack. Let's go ahead and see what we have in this one. Um, yeah, things have just been really well. Uh, Pre-release happened, so I think I'm going to also release... Ooh, we, see, we got something in this one, too. Uh, I think I'm going to also be doing a pre-release video. Uh, the, uh, the the polls and stuff were interesting from Unified Minds, so I did go to my first pre-release last night for Unified Minds. That was an absolute blast. We, with this booster pack, we're going to kick things off with a great energy card. We have a strong energy right there. I will definitely not complain about getting that. We have the supporter card, Shauna. Next, we have a Pupitar. We have a Diglett. We have a Larvitar, we have an awesome looking Meow, we have a Coughing, we have a Burmy, we have a Zygarde, and we pulled a Deontay EX. This card makes me happy because actually I think it was from Furious Fist. I don't think it was this one, but Deontay, I remember using Deontay, the Mega Deontay EX uh, back when it first came out. It was actually a pretty pretty cool card, pretty, uh, pretty decent card actually back in...
the EX was really cool to see, uh, really cool pull to see right there. Uh, we have three Unbroken Bond Pokemon Booster Packs, Sun and Moon, I think we have a Burning Shadows, some team up stuff, so let's go ahead and keep this video rolling. Uh, let's see, if we pulled a Rainbow Rare Charizard from any of these Pokemon Booster Packs, I probably would, I would probably freak out. Um, I, I don't think, I, I don't think I've seen it pulled personally. I do think I've had a couple friends that have pulled the Notorious a Rainbow Rare Charizard, but honestly, there's a lot of other really great cards from the set that I would not complain about getting either. Try to, I try to hide the green code the best I can. I've done plenty of booster pack openings. I should be able to hide that better, but let's go ahead and see what we kick things off with. We have a awesome looking fairy type energy right there. One of my friends, he's notorious. He says he does not like this energy design. I think that this energy design looks fine. Uh, next, we have a Tokatik. We have a Koga's Trap. We have a, another power plant. We've gotten some really good cards tonight. Cottony, an Ekans, a Carvana, Litten, Clefairy, adorable looking Clefairy, a Reverse Hall Surprise Box, and we have a Miss Magius. This card is seeing a bit of play right now. It is pretty cool. Um, let's go ahead and jump into the next Pokemon Booster Pack. So definitely a mix of things tonight, but I'm still I'm happy with both of those EXs from the XY era. Opening Booster Packs is just, it's just a fun thing to do. Let's go ahead and see what we have in this one. I have been notorious for green codes for green codes but i have one cool card to show at the end that i did buy specifically for my birthday i was very happy to get it let's go ahead and see what we have here next we kick things off with a water energy an ultra forest uh carton boy i actually am not familiar with this card doesn't team uh, uh unbroken bonds have been out for a minute dusk tone could have a lot of potential i think in the expanded format next we have haunter we have rhyhorn we have a meltan we have a spear we have a lick tongue we have a litten we have a Kogus Trap, we have a Sungfish, and that's everything from that booster pack. We have about seven more Pokemon booster packs right here. Uh, one of these are from the Detective Pikachu set from the Mewtwo. Mewtwo, uh, uh, Mewtwo EX, uh, not Mewtwo EX, Mewtwo GX Detective Pikachu collection case file thing, whatever <laughs> whatever it's called. Uh, this is another Unbroken Bond booster pack. I think this is the last Unbroken Bond booster pack I have tonight. No Rainbow Rare Charizard because that is another green code, but that's okay. There's a lot of cool cards we can still get from this set. We kick things off with a lightning energy. We have a happening. It's very interesting that now they decided to bring back egg Pokemon after all this time. If these guys I think could be better. Um, next we have a Metal Core Barrier. We have a Tentacruel. We have a Grubbin. A Ghastly. A Gligar. A Spritzy. A Do Duo. Reverse Hollow Ultra Cartenvoy. And our last card is the very cool looking Alolan Duck Trio. So let's go ahead, jump into Sun and Moon pack. Actually, I think I know what we'll do. We'll do all of, we'll save the Detective Pikachu packs for the last. And we'll just go through the three next Sun and Moon Pokemon Booster packs. We have one base set Sun and Moon, Burning Shadows, and Team Up. We'll go back from the most recent one, starting with the Team Up one. So let's see if we can get a Pikachu Zekrom or anything like that would be cool. Cool way to kick, uh, continue the night. We try to actually hide the code so I don't see what it is either. And we can both we can all be surprised together. Kick things off with a Psychic Energy, a Flaffy, Jinx, Kangaskhan, Joltik, Blitzel, a Squirtle, a Tentacruel, Grimer, Reverse Hall Evodle, that's really cool, and we have an Alone Muck. That was actually a pretty cool, pretty cool Pokemon booster pack. We have two more Pokemon booster packs to go. Well, uh, Burning Shadows first, and we're going back from the oldest, uh, most recent from the three that we had there. Got here. Doo, doo, doo. That is a white coat. That's promising already. More from the back. And let's see what we have here. We kick things off with a steel energy. We have a Kiawe. Sad to see this card going. We have an Olivia. We have a Buffalant. I always pronounce this one wrong. We have a Riolu. We have a Meowth. We have an Alone Vulpix. We have a Wimpod. We have a Toka Tokadamaru. Reverse Hall Butterfree. And we have a Hollow Lucario. Looks pretty awesome. We have one more Sun Moon Booster Pack, and then we have the smaller Detected, uh, Detected Pikachu sets, and then that'll be this video, and then hopefully the next video, I really do want to be getting out Pokemon videos every Wednesday and Friday is what I want to be aiming to do. I do miss doing these videos. Uh, four from the back, and then this will be the last Pokemon Booster Pack, and I think I know how I'm going to do the Detected Pikachu pack so we can kind of get through those quickly. I'm going to open those all up at the same time. We have a Fairy Energy. Next, we have a Bri uh, Bryone. I, I always forget how to pronounce that one. Uh, Lolan Persian. We have a Switch, very practical card. A Skarmory, Morlul, Fomantis, Spiro, Pikepec, 
reverse all parasect and we have a cloister so that is pretty cool definitely definitely got some cool looking cards from the xy ones those are the most promising one um yeah like i said just because the detective pikachu packs are so small i was going to try to open all those up at once and just set those over here um just so i don't have to keep going through the same process but uh yeah let me know down in the comments if there's anything excited if this, if this is your first year playing pokemon if you're just playing online what do you want to do with the pokemon uh like uh, uh upcoming pokemon season and like i said the like the videos i want to make is actually like explaining what all these like kind of kind of really just breaking down the competitive scene what are booster packs and just anything ins and outs of the pokemon uh of, of the pokemon trading card game like I said, we're going to go through all of these, all of the Detective Pikachu booster packs at once. These are from the Mewtwo collection. I have the Mewtwo set around here somewhere. I'm trying to see where it is around my desk. And then hopefully I'm also going to be trying to get some friends and stuff involved with this channel as well and really starting to do some stuff with it. This is the boost booster pack number four. And then we have one more Detective Pikachu pack. And that'll be 14 Pokemon boost. I think this is 14 Pokemon booster pack, so not too shabby of an opening. So trying to kind of go for slightly larger openings than do how I was doing them every single day. And I definitely feel out of touch a little bit. Not to say that you get used talking in, fr in front of a camera every day. So I feel like less seasoned than I was a couple months ago when I was actively doing uploading videos every single day. But it's still a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and see what we have in these. It's about probably 12 cards right here from Detective Pikachu. We have Moralul. We have a Bulbasaur. We have a Magikarp. Mr. Mime. Another Magikarp. Uh, an adorable looking Charmander. This Charmander actually, I might have some ideas for him. We have a Mol another Molu, Mewtwo, probably one of the coolest cards from this set. Bulbasaur, Lickitung, Jigglypuff, another Mr. Mime, another Magic Card. We've gotten a lot of these. Another Charmander, Moralul, and we have a Greninja. That is pretty cool. Like I said uh, in the, one of the, I think the last video, Detective Pikachu's that really was just kind of like a grab, uh, uh, money, a money grab for the movie. But two cards I got uh, with that one of them was the Mewtwo GX that came with it. And then specifically for my birthday, just something I think I've said this in videos a long time ago, I've wanted to get a full art Cynthia for a very, very long time. So I actually went out and I was able to buy one today. So that was just kind of something sweet and extra I did for my birthday. But fellow trainers, I hope you enjoyed this video if you made it this point and just let me know anything down in the comments below Pokemon related. I don't really know how I'm uh, structuring uh, this channel. I, I do know what I want to do. Wednesday, Wednesdays and Fridays, I want to upload videos. I want to start doing stuff more daily-ish, sort of, over on Instagram. Uh, writing things about the Pokemon trading card game and just I really once I start uploading video I think I will be able to get in the habit of doing this regularly live streams and all that jazz Maybe maybe eventually move it up to a Monday Wednesday and Friday sort of thing But just kind of experiment and see where things go fellow trainers I hope you're having a great day whenever you're watching this and I will see you next time Hey Pokemon fans, this is part two to an amazing weekend ahead if I get both these videos up this week.